Real Agriculture Outcomes coverage of NCBA 2012 in Nashville is brought to you by The Corn School. Visit us at cornschool.com and Haney Farms, the certified barley and corn seed for the silage yield you want. We're at NCBA 2012. We're here with Tim. Tim is with the Hoop Beef System. Tim, what is it? The Hoop Beef System is a covered cattle feeding facility which uh, allows uh, you, the cattleman, to uh, take the weather out of the equation and allow your cattle to perform at the genetic potential and uh, reap the benefits from that. Okay, so this is a little bit different. We're, keep, we're going to put cattle inside, basically. Almost, yes. Almost like a, not quite a dairy situation, but we're keeping them out of the elements. What are some of the benefits? The biggest benefit we're going to see is uh, improvement in feed efficiency, and especially with today's high feed cost. You know, smaller differences in feed efficiency can have a big impact on our bottom line. We've compared our closeouts for the past five years to a national benchmark uh, uh, system here in the United States, and we consistently see over a 17% improvement in feed efficiency. And in today's world, that's worth about $125 a head. Yeah. So it's a big impact. So uh, we can see on the screen here, or on the, the signs, what, what, are, what is the cost per square foot of, us, of uh, buildings like this? You're going to be looking at about a finished cost if you hired all the labor, depending on your local concrete cost. You're going to be right around that $10 a square foot, or with the square footage we give the cattle about $450 per head of capacity. Interestingly enough, with today's fertilizer prices, the fertilizer coming out of the building will pay for the structure. That makes sense. That makes sense. So, so a lot of uh, traditional feeders would probably say, ah, you know, this, is, this isn't how the West was won. This is a little crazy. What, what, what is the feedback from some of your customers? Well, I have to kind of give a, a more uh, six six years ago, when we started with the hoop beef system, uh, Doc Bryant, the founder of hoop beef system, had been feeding cattle under roof for over 40 years. And looking at it, when we started telling our story, it was about why to feed cattle under roof. Now we're telling the story about the economic advantages because the weather we've had in the past three to five years, I don't care where you're at in the United States or Canada, it's been a bear. You know, and we've uh, actually sustained some quite a bit of economic loss due to the weather factor. So people understand the benefit of getting their cattle under roof, and now it's about how do I do it. We don't sell anything that we haven't proven to ourselves to work and work well. We have our own research and development farm in Northwest Iowa. We use the same buildings our customers do every day. So basically, we can see on the screen here, you, you, the pens are a lot drier too. So there's a yes. huge, like that's one of the huge benefits, right? The big thing that our goal is is to keep the cattle dry. If cattle have a clean, dry hair coat, they can, their thermal neutral zone, which they don't expend any more energy to maintain body function, is 19 to 85 degrees. You get outside that, and they start expending more energy to either stay warm or to keep cool. And with a clean, dry hair coat inside the building, there's very minimal the number of days, even in the northern tier. We have customers in North Dakota that where those cattle are where we want them to be so they can reach their genetic potential. There you go.